Have you ever wondered what exactly enables a DC machine to function smoothly without any sparks? Today, we're going to reveal that secret. It's all down to a little-known component called the Interpol. This unsung hero plays a vital role in the seamless operation of DC machines. It's not the size, but the function that matters, and the Interpol certainly proves it. Curious to know more about this crucial part? So let's delve deeper and understand this unsung hero of the DC machine, the Interpol. Interpols play a fundamental role in the seamless operation of a DC machine. Let's take a moment to truly understand the function of the Interpol. Essentially, its job is to reduce sparking at the brushes of the DC machine. Now you might be wondering, how does it achieve this? Well, the answer lies in the way it neutralizes the armature reaction in the commutation zone. This is the area where the current flowing through the armature coils reverses its direction. Because of the armature reaction, this zone doesn't remain stationary and tends to shift, resulting in poor commutation and sparking at the brushes. Now, this is where the interpole steps in. It's a small coil of wire placed between the main poles of the DC machine. It's connected in series with the armature and carries the same current. The magnetic field produced by the interpole then counters the effect of the armature reaction in the commutation zone. This means that the interpole neutralizes the shifting magnetic field caused by the armature reaction, keeping the commutation zone steady. As a result, the current reversal in the armature coils occurs smoothly without causing any sparking at the brushes. This is a crucial function because sparking can lead to unnecessary wear and tear and even damage the machine. But that's not all. The Interpol also performs another important function. It helps to maintain a constant speed in the DC machine. You see, when the load on the machine changes, the armature current also changes, which can affect the machine's speed. But since the Interpol is connected in series with the armature, any change in the armature current will also change the Interpol's magnetic field. This helps to counteract the effect of the changing load, maintaining a constant speed. So, you see, the Interpol is the unsung hero of the DC machine, silently ensuring its smooth and efficient operation. In essence, without the Interpol, a DC machine would struggle to perform its operations without sparking. The efficiency of an Interpol is largely determined by its design and placement within the DC machine. Stepping into the realm of the Interpol's design, you'll find that it's quite distinct. The Interpol is designed to possess a robust magnetic field. This isn't a random decision, but an intentional design choice. The strong magnetic field is crucial because it aids in the neutralization of the armature's self-induced EMF. This, in turn, reduces the sparking that can occur during the commutation process. Now, let's consider the Interpol's placement. It's not haphazardly thrown into the mix, but strategically positioned in the commutation zone. This specific placement is necessary because it's where the changeover from one commutator segment to another happens. By having the Interpol in this zone, it can effectively neutralize the self-induced EMF at the precise moment it's needed. The Interpol isn't just a component sitting in the DC machine. It's a carefully designed and strategically placed element. It's like a chess player, knowing when and where to make the right move. The Interpol makes its move precisely when the commutation process begins, ensuring the smooth running of the DC machine. In essence, the design and placement of the Interpol aren't just about aesthetics or random positioning. They serve a vital purpose reducing sparking, ensuring efficient commutation, and ultimately, enhancing the performance of the DC machine. The design and placement of the Interpol are vital to its function in reducing sparking and enhancing the performance of the DC machine. So, what have we learned about the Interpol of a DC machine? In our journey to understand this key component, we've delved into the function of the Interpol we've discovered its crucial role in minimizing sparking in the machine, thus maintaining the machine's health and longevity. 
It's the interpole that ensures consistent and smooth current flow, enhancing the overall operation of the DC machine. We've also explored the design and placement of the interpole. Nestled between the main poles, the interpole is designed to be in sync with the armature's magnetic field. This strategic positioning and design allow the interpole to effectively counteract the armature reaction, a feat that sets the stage for a seamless operation. From all these insights, one thing becomes clear. The interpole is not just an add-on, but an essential part of the DC machine. From reducing sparking to enhancing the overall operation of the DC machine, the Interpol proves to be an essential component, ensuring the machine's smooth and efficient performance.